Hello. In this video I'll show Mandelbrot Fractal. Before we start, don't forget that you can subscribe for more content. So, this is a Mandelbrot Fractal. How it looks. It is generated by Shader, written in Gulsal. I'll soon describe how it works. Firstly, one of parameters in the shader is number of iterations. Now I increased number of iterations, let's see difference, it became more clear. I changed color scheme and added a few slider to manage, so let me describe what is this all. So Mandelbrot Fractal is what you see. More precisely it's Mandelbrot set, set of points in complex number space. We can define it using an iterative formula, what is done in the shader. For each iteration we can check current point can be part of Mandelbrot set, or exactly can't. If can and it reached last iteration, then it is colored black. Otherwise, its color depends on number of iterations. Let's check different sites. You can see, that I can't go too deep, cause of rectangular artifacts, it's because the shader works on 64-bit float values. For infinite diving, I'd need to use arbitrary precision numbers. There are so much different, but the same features.
I slightly changed color scheme again. Also, you can notice two new sliders. Let's see what they do. Oh no, our Mandelbrot set is deformed now. In general, we can define very many rules to generate a complex number set and draw fractal as well. There is many color schemes. If honestly, I still don't know how all it works. I have to learn this properly. So, I added a new feature to color scheme. I don't know how to name it. As a result, this drawn using this Gossel shader code. Okay, this is the end. I need to explore this topic more. Subscribe and set like if you love such things. I'm going to create more videos.